What would it be like if beauty didn't exist? Beauty is a model coming from outside. In the social media era, where everything is connected, everything is faster, we lost the perception of time, we lost the perception of distance, and we lost the perception of experience. Never back in history were people craving so desperately for uh, approval. When someone comes to my studio and they say I want to be photographed by you and I, I perceive that something is not working because they are acting uh, too artificially, they are being too fake, I always wonder where is the real personality of this person gone? Why is this person being so fake? Is, is fake attractive and why is fake attractive? As Confucius used to say, everything is beautiful, everything has beauty, but not everyone sees it, unfortunately. <sighs> c'est que c'est que la beauté, qui est une beauté, moi je considère, est une beauté euh, éternelle, ça n'a pas de temps, ça n'a pas de lieu. Après, il y a la, la vraie beauté, que c'est autre chose. La vraie beauté, c'est de l'esprit, la vraie beauté, c'est de l'essence. La vraie beauté, c'est un regard, c'est un sourire, c'est un... l'expressivité d'un nom. The, the beauty in clothes and people is simplicity. As simple lines in a coat, in a cut of a dress. It's always very important to, to balance. La robe portée, ça peut être portée sur un porte-manteau, comme dans, dans, on le voit dans tous les défilés. Après, quand quelqu'un porte une robe, ou un costume, peu importe, là, ça, ça revient justement la, la, la personnalité, la lumière, la, la, la luminosité de la peau, l'expressivité des l'ongle de tout à l'heure. Beauty in a portrait is the age of a portrait. Seen from afar, a portrait is beautiful. Seen from afar, a portrait is perfect. But the closer you get, the more cracks you see in the canvas, the more imperfections you see. Beauty in that case lies in the imperfection. Imperfection is the time that the portrait has seen, the time that it has lived, cracks given by air and light. That is what beauty is in a portrait. Là, on revient à la beauté classique, je pense. C'est de la lumière, c'est le jeu d'ombre. Là, il y a toute une étude. C'est moins euh, casual, c'est moins évident, quoi. Ça n'arrive moins par hasard, hasardeux. Voilà. We have to unfocus from that point of view and we should start to change and gain a new view, a new point of view on beauty, because beauty never existed. You should not allow anyone to tell you whether you're beautiful or not, and moreover this is not even your problem, because you are beautiful but you are something more than that. There is no greater gift and you can make to yourself than being your own definition of beauty. Thank you.